performers, ladies and gentlemen, a 1943 stock steerman with Mr. John Moore rolling that airplane right off takeoff. And watch as he gets back to upright, he'll do a snap roll. Now, I want to tell you, this airplane weighs 2,000 pounds when it's empty. When you gross it out, it's about 2,800 pounds. It's a big, heavy airplane. John Moore from Moore Barnstorming doing a nice turn there. He'll keep this right in front of you, folks, because that's the way John flies this airplane. He restored it back in 1975. It's totally stock, 220 horsepower, just the way it came off that Steerman assembly line back in 1943. A 67-year-old airplane, a Steerman PT-17. The Steerman originally designed by Lloyd Steerman. And later it was built by Boeing Aircraft of Wichita, Kansas. Airplanes. As he comes back into the show area, that air show smoke system trailing, up he goes through about five eighths of a loop. This is a lesson in aerobatics, ladies and gentlemen. Coming down on the 45 degree line, he will roll that airplane half a turn back to upright. He is performing the classic Cuban 8, the bigger 8 lying on its side directly in front of you. Once again, coming through the five eighths loop. again that beautiful steerman up and over the top yeah we've even put a little funny spinning music in there for you today too as we watch this wonderful performance isn't that a beautiful airplane as we look at the top side as he goes over in this barrel roll john has been performing at air shows for many years he's won many awards the bill barber award the art show He's an inductee of the Minnesota Aviation Hall of Fame. And if you get the Smithsonian, you will find in the August edition an article on John Moore. First got together with John back in the 1990s, somewhere here in Canada where he was doing air shows. And of course, uh, he's been on the air show circuit ever since. He's the show area down to the western end of the field. And yes, he operates very close to the ground. He'll get himself turned around, line himself up with the show line, come back into the show area, and uh, as he gets back to the show line, he'll go into the night bench. There's four points, five, six, and seven. He'll do the eight-point roll. Now this airplane does not have an inverted fuel and oil system. In other words, it's not equipped to fly upside down for any extended period of time. So frequently, when he holds it in the inverted, that fuel will build up in there and you'll hear that airplane backfire and a great big stream of fire will come out of it. But don't worry, that's all part of it. Coming back into show center now, the super slow roll. Looks a whole lot easier. There it is. Don't be frightened. Fire. That's okay. The super slow roll looks a lot easier to do than it really is. And John is going to climb away there at the western end of the field and just came a little bit of altitude there. I want to tell you that the controls of this airplane are extremely heavy, and in many of his aerobatic maneuvers, he has two hands on the stick. He's got strong muscles. Trying to get that thing to do what he wants it to do. So he's getting a workout in that airplane today. Okay, climbing for a little bit of altitude there because altitude translates into airspeed and altitude and airspeed are an aerobatic pilot's best friend. So coming back into show center now, diving to gain some additional airspeed. Let's see what he's going to do this time. Okay, up he goes. Pushes the plane over on its back, and from that 45 degree line, this is a reverse Cuban 8. A Cuban 8 done in the reverse from what he did previously. And up he goes. Again, rolls the airplane from that 45 degree up line over on its back, completes 5 eighths of a loop, and completes the reverse Cuban 8. The Cuban 8 
done backwards from what he did it the first time. Straight up, 90 degree turn to take him across the top. And he'll pull the nose sharply down about now. And across the bottom, the maneuver known as the square loop. John Moore, all the way from Minnesota, and we say hi to Lynn out there today, his wife, who uh, <laughs> travels with him. A great aerobatic pilot, great team uh, they are. Okay, quarter roll up. There's the hammerhead turn. Oh, that's cool. And as he comes back down another quarter turn, that puts him right back on the show line and heading in the opposite direction, ready for his next maneuver. Again, taking the airplane up, quarter turn. We're looking at the bottom of the airplane now. There's the hammerhead turn. As John comes back down towards the ground, a quarter turn on the down line. And again, there he is, right on his show line, exiting the airport to the west. Job on that airplane makes it very easy to see against this beautiful Abbotsford sky here today.